Finally, once you're happy with your presentation, it's time to publish it. Let's have a look at how easy it is to do that. When you're ready, you can basically create some little details for your piece. So for instance, you need to give it a title. Well, I've got trucks and I've got Web 2.0, so I'm going to call it Web 2.0 Convoy, very original. Then you add a description, so obviously people that are browsing can get a quick idea of what it is you've created. So here we have trucks full of uh, Web 2.0 goodness. You can then publish it either to your default channel, which will be in your username, or you can choose another channel if you've created different channels, which you can publish to. You can also quickly send out an email to invite friends or family to come and have a look at that at the Viewvox website. And when you're done, you click on save, and then we'll be able to get the embed code and have a look at the finished presentation. This can take a while if you're actually using things that you've uploaded from your hard drive, but from the web it's pretty quick as you can see. So we can click on view now, or we can also choose between three different embed types, thumbnails with descriptions, a window type, and a full screen type, and that will give you the requisite code that you just plug into your blog or web page. Copy the code and there you go. So let's have a look at the end result, what have we got? So here it is, this is the end presentation with the background and the images and the customization I selected. I can get the embed code, the link and the email link directly from here. I can view it in full screen and with this navbar here I can scroll between the different slides.